So I purchased this 2023 Moto Guzzi V85 TT and I traded my BMW R1200 GS Adventure on it. I really like it, but the wind and buffeting on the BMW was really well controlled, perfect design. And on the Moto Guzzi is actually truly horrendous in its stock format. So I went ahead and purchased the DEBYL Technologies uh, 3D printed air dam. It looks quite stock. It's uh, really well made and it made a difference on its own. I could tell that there was a difference that it made and also it clears the, the forks, no problem. It's well designed. And as far as installing, if you bought this or if you're planning on buying this, make sure that you put both both bolts at the same time. Um, as for the laminar lip that you are seeing here, I wanted to also include that with the wind mitigation project because the air dam alone did not cut it. So I used uh, duct tape, uh, this yellow duct tape, to try different positions and I took a few rides. And I found that this position here is the one that made me uh, more content. So I mounted it about three and a half inches from the side, on each side, and about uh, two inches from center to top of the windshield. Um, so again, three and a half inches from the sides and two inches from the center of the top button to the top. So it's dual lock 3M adhesive. Uh, the dual locks, of course, are very strong and the adhesive is supposed to take 24 hours to cure. So once I found this final position here, that it's actually a little bit uh, higher than the manufacturer recommendation, um, I'm going to go with it anyway. So I use this Sharpie to mark the position. So I'm just laying some ink down on the back of the inside of the windshield for positioning. And so when I remove the duct tape and I remove the sticker from the back of the dual lock, I will simply uh, sit on the motorcycle and place the adhesives on top of the four dark spots that I will be able to see on my windshield. So that's it. It works really well.